Why? I should really be saying my stuff. Making fresh waffles. Here's a nice glimpse of it. We're selling it for $2. What a steal. Oh, no. Senior the writing center. was, I mean, you see the shack they were living in before, and she had 10 people in there, and not all of them were her family members. Mm -hmm. And so one of the things that she was so excited about her new house was just more space to invite So inspired more. this afternoon by what I was able to witness as I walked um, up and down the hallways. Um, I will take with me, and I hope that they're in here, the group that is working for the education of Nigerian women. That is a project that really spoke to me. So I want to be involved in that change in a very, very uh, deep way. In a small farm that was the original Woodburn Elementary School mm -hmm. over on Woodburn Road. So when I was a little boy in the 1950s, men would come by, knock on the door, and say, can I come in and look around here? I went to school in 1897 in this building. <laughs> and uh, Annandale was a very, very different place uh, when I was growing up. Across the street from me were African-American families where the land had been deeded to them in the will of George Washington. Mm. A lot of history here in Fairfax. But things have changed and changed so much for the better because when I was a little boy, those children who lived across the street from me, they didn't get to go to my brand new Woodburn Elementary School. Okay. They have to go to Other thoughts? Discrimination. Discrimination. Okay, yes. So I'll put that under social justice, right? There are a lot of... Um, you know, prejudices, that goes to what you said about <coughs> kindness, right? Somebody else said poverty. Okay, very good. So yeah, related to equity, of course. Poverty. Okay, increasing, yes, an increasing issue in our community. Uh, human trafficking, 